topic, ma'am, you're only going to find the negative at every point. <laughs> and I just pick out the obvious flaws in the system to which you support greatly, which is the problem. I don't. You do. I'm, you don't think that's, that's, that's a lie. See, it's an outright lie. You've become very rich on the backs of people. To think no. that's all you have, period. Fine. No. Okay. So yeah. you know what? I've said my piece. Knock yourselves out. That the more you do it, the less interest I get. And you don't have that many guys that you get in the boardroom. Lives, no, young guys. Thank it's you. It's irresponsible. Thank you. Doing this is your time. Who's your voice oh, I don't own it. So I know that, yeah, but you're yeah, advocating for it, you're perpetuating it, and you're standing up and saying, okay, I just want to make sure that so the taxpayers of this, what should we do? Should we, should we lose another hundred million or get it back in so that Gregor can go do some responsible things for housing? I wouldn't. Ultimately, it's going to cost. We don't believe that, that how people come if we give up this place. And then the city has to pay for housing somewhere. It's a so continual like, who's indicated to you they're giving it to you? It's like a carrot at the end of the stick. Like they, they sent out the message when they said that this this space is going to be 66% social housing. Okay, so when they didn't. You should have been in their board. And trust we me, were. we were. We've we tried, tried every We've process here, every and this is the last one. This is we've tried everything. So who sent, who sent out a message that's going to change? What? Who sent out a message that's going to change? The city has 740 million at risk here. Yeah. My job is to try and get the 500 million back. And then there's other assets. There's the commercial assets. There's the rental. There's etc. But if they take a big loss here. They're not going to have money for whether it's for housing or swimming pools or, or, or fire and safety. But the money has to come from somewhere. He is correct. Yeah. I'm the Deputy General Manager for Community Services. I oversee housing. We have we have 14 sites that we're working with the province spring and fall. We have a housing strategy that if you'll have seen, I presented with the city manager and one of my housing staff a couple of weeks ago. We're talking about trying to secure another thing. Possibly for more supportive housing. We're looking at more affordable rental housing opportunities. You've never seen housing being developed like you have in all the city. The city is at risk. 742 million dollars. I take it as a huge responsibility to try and make it as much as possible to stabilize the tax base. I can't do it. I'm not the guy that can do it all. But you've got somebody on your side. Find it irresponsible that you don't ever pick up the phone. Let's sit down and talk how we can do it. Because I have the developer's checkbook. He'll listen to me that if he can provide non market, 